why this program increases your nutrient levels. Healing your bowel and body with this program increases your nutrient levels in a way that crutches, whether it's exercise, diets, food allergy, wheat free, high protein, low carb, whatever, diets, um, acupuncture, massage, chiropractic, and even nutrient intake like vitamin supplementation cannot do. In fact, you could do this program and heal your bowel and body, never even take a nutrient per se, and you will still end up with higher nutrient levels at the end of this than the many of you and many of those people out there who are ingesting tons and tons and tons and tons of vitamins and other nutrients on a day-to-day -day basis. When you have excess and uneliminated acids in your blood, your body comes to the rescue to protect you against that because that is dangerous. And one of the many ways your body protects against those uneliminated acids is by using up nutrients, whether it's vitamin C, A, E, B vitamins, you name it, zinc, etc., etc. Nutrients get soaked up, used up, depleted to buffer and protect you against those uneliminated acids. Their way is to keep pumping tons of vitamins into you. My way, which is way more effective, is to take that acidity and eliminate it in the first place. That's what you do when you heal your body with this program. You eliminate those acids and when you do that, you eliminate the great demand on your body for nutrients. Our need for nutrients is actually quite small. These RDAs that everyone complains is way too little, they're really not. They're based on what a healthy body needs. Of course, no one really has a healthy body, so that's why the needs are higher. The more acidic and toxic you are, yeah, the more your nutrient level needs go up. Get rid of the acidity or toxicity, as this program does, and those levels plummet down to those tiny little RDA levels, which, by the way, are extremely easy to meet um, with a healthy diet, even poor soil and all. And when you heal your bowel body with this program, by the way, you will want to eat a healthy diet. Lots of vegetables and grains and nuts and cheese and lots of nutrient-dense foods. But the point is that it's the acidity that depletes the nutrients. It's way more effective to get rid of the acids and have your nutrient levels go up that way than it is just to keep piling more and more nutrients onto it. So get rid of the trash rather than constantly spraying more and more and more and more perfume on it to make things smell good. Just get rid of the trash in the first place. When you heal your bowel with this program, with the bowel strength or the unique healing probiotics, you create a healthy bacterial environment and that environment is also directly responsible for the absorption of many nutrients from your food, like calcium and others. It also plays an integral role in the absorption of things like vitamin B12, vitamin K, vitamin D, some of the other B vitamins, calcium. So when your bowel is healthy, you get more of these nutrients manufactured and absorbed than when it's not healthy. Healing your bowel with this program is much more effective than just constantly piling those supplements on you. When your bowel and body are healthy, you will have incredibly high levels of nutrients in your body. But until they are healthy, body bentonite increases nutrient levels. Even though there are no vitamins and minerals in bentonite, it does that because, again, it gets rid of the acids that otherwise cause them to be depleted. You can take the Unique Healing Calcium Citrate, even though it's just calcium, it will buffer acids, which will spare your body of all nutrients. So if those acids are buffered, they're no longer um, threatening your body's health or life or longevity, and therefore all the vitamins and minerals in your body will be protected against becoming depleted to protect you against those acids. So I could give someone calcium and have their B vitamin levels increase. I could give someone calcium and have their magnesium levels increase, um, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Keeping in mind that most vitamins all do the same thing. doesn't matter what it's called, they all have many unique important jobs, but they also all can act to protect you against those acids. So when those acids aren't threatening you, all of them um, are spared. All of them become healthier and stronger. Vitamin B12, the methyl B12 that I recommend, of course, is another way to get your B12 levels up until your gut is healthy enough to do that. Um, the neat thing, of course, about this program is that you're not just doing B12 forever. You one day will have a healthy gut to absorb that. I myself have not taken methyl B12 in 22 years, I think. I don't know. It's been a very long time. Um, so you will get to that point once your gut is healthy, too. 
As far as misunderstandings about all this, uh, I say here it's not that complicated. What I mean by that is, and I kind of touched on this, that it's, it's not, there's so much uh, distraction, how about that? Um, so many companies too that are marketing to you and, and profiting, profiting handsomely by doing this, um, by you know presenting you, hey, they've got the next greatest vitamin and it's presented in a way that it's absorbed better than everyone else's or there's the new magic vitamin that's gonna cure everything. This has been going on for at least 25 years. Um, in other words, many of you are in the shoes that I was in 25 years ago where you are led to believe that your health problems um, are all going to be solved once that one missing nutrient that's causing them is discovered or, or figured out. Again, it's not that complicated. Most vitamins do the same thing. It does not matter, as I always say, if you get your perfume from Target, from Macy's, from Saks, from Victoria's Secret, if you just use enough of it, the trash will smell better. Okay, there's a massive redundancy as far as vitamins go. Um, you do need more as your body becomes more toxic and your bowel becomes more unhealthy. So there is this trend towards higher and higher intake and um, levels of nutrients being used. Uh, I don't know how far that will go before you all say enough, enough, too expensive, too difficult to do. But um, I predict you will continue to see that happening um, as people who are not doing this program find that again. They need more and more of this stuff to feel as good as they did before. I think one of the biggest things I do want to stress is there was a very well done, accurate, significant, relevant study came out I think about two or three years ago, a long-term study which showed that people who take vitamins die at the exact same rate as people who don't. Getting acids out of your body saves your life. Taking vitamins doesn't get acids out and it will not extend your life. That's what the studies show. Um, so stop the focus on the nutrients in, whether it's from your diet or whatever. You know, it's a hard thing to switch gears because there's so much focus on this in the media and whatever. There's so much focus on this. But to do something that all these people aren't doing, which is to live a very long, healthy, high quality life, the focus needs to shift. It's not about vitamins in, it's about acids out. When the acids go out, you will be nutritionally very healthy. I do have more information on this in my second book, Unique Healing 2, which will be out in May of 2012. Unique Healing 1 will give you a lot more information about nutrients as well. And um, as always, my website, www.uniquehealing.com will give you more information, access to more videos, as well as access to scheduling an appointment if you should care to consult with me. So I hope that helps.